Welcome to Maidstone, and I'm with Cole Hurst, who has uh, had an absolute baller of a weekend. Cole, you've, had, you've, you've set, all, set up all this, the arena, with your friends, and of course all the TV screens, lighting, sound and everything. How long does that take? It takes about eight hours normally on a Friday, so we arrive at 8am on a Friday morning, and we're normally done by 6 to 8 o'clock, so 10 to 12 hours really. A lot of tea, a lot of coffee, a lot of biscuits, um, but yeah, no, keep it. Keep it going. You're probably going to hate me for asking this, but has there been any accidents that you don't want to talk about or any problems that you've ever had in the past? Because it's normally the same setup for each show, but obviously when you're in a... I mean, this is a small venue compared to the others that we've been this year. Is this is this one quite a challenge? Every venue is different um, and always has its challenges. Um, it just depends on what... Well, yeah, what's trapped at us, really. But... Uh, no, no, Every install is really good. Um, we love doing the shows. Um, we always get a good buzz from it. The crew's fantastic, as you know. Um, and yeah, no, we really, really enjoy it. And, and I, I obviously during the shows, I'm, I'm sometimes with you and your crew. You know, doing the, doing the lighting and the fades and everything. So obviously, there's quite a lot of, there's quite a lot to, uh, to do during the show as well. So you're very on it. Yeah, it's, um, it's, it's like any theatre show really. Um, there's a lot of script. There's a lot of uh, cues that you have to learn, um, and you. you basically it's got to be on the ball basically um listen to presenters listen to uh what robots are coming in and uh yeah just obviously go with it and uh, it's a live show it's not it's not like what you see on tv uh, anything can happen so you've really got to be on the ball with it were you a robot wars fan before you got involved with extreme robots yes i was yeah so um not as big um but i must admit when i first turned up and saw matilda for the first time i thought ah oh, yeah, okay. I'm not sure if we're allowed to say Matilda now because that's obviously BBC copyright, but uh, okay. <laughs> well, you've yeah. said it now. <laughs> I know. Um, but there was a moment of like, wow, yeah, okay, this is real. And they're a lot bigger in real life as well. I yeah. didn't think the robots were that big. Um, and everyone asked me, why is the arena so heavy and so big? Um, come and see the show and you'll find out why. <laughs> that's the easiest way to describe it. I think that's it, though. I think if you try and get someone new into something like this, it's... They should expect the unexpected because I, I remember my first time, uh, I think it was in, um, it was not Portsmouth, it was Guildford. And I just remember just realising how much safety is involved. And how big everything is, yeah. And how big everything is, yeah, exactly. Well, Cole, you, you've, you've got your coffee. I think, I think you're going to need it because it's another busy day ahead. Two shows, are you ready? Always, definitely. Born ready? Yeah, yeah born ready. Yeah, yeah definitely. Coffee. coffee gets us free. <laughs> Remember, of course, do check out Production Hype Event Solutions uh, if you ever do need a help at your local event.